Hello guys, Essential Football, that's, I might change my name, but I don't know. Welcome to the most important video you will ever watch. It's my Premier League Players of the Year. Screw the PFA, PFA who, in my opinion. Mine are different, mine are better, I have more awards. Right, I'll go through the awards. Awards up for grabs are, Best Goalkeeper, Best Defender, Best midfielder, best right winger, best left winger, best striker, goal of the season, manager of the season, personality of the year, young player of the year, player of the year, best skiller of the year, and my favourite player of the year. Now let's... <coughs> Let's go. The best goalkeeper of the year, for me, was a hard decision. There's been a few good goalkeepers here. Czech has been amazing. David De Gea has been amazing. Peter Schmeichel has been amazing. But due to him having the highest rate of clean sheets in the season, I'm going to have to give this award to Peter Schmeichel. So my hands are covered in ink. Um, yeah, DT, sort of. Yeah. The best defender of the year. <sighs> Who do you go for? Do you go for Koscielny? Koscielny's been good this year. Do you go for Robert Hoof? In my opinion, someone stands out and I've just seen him. He just looks solid. He gets around his job and he shows passion. And that is exactly what you need from a centre-back. Wes Morgan. Slightly lesser dominated uh, players of the year. Best midfielder. Hmm, <laughs> easy for me. In me, easy for me. This is like a central midfielder. N'Golo Kante without... A doubt, absolutely fantastic season. Right on to the best right winger, Riyad Mahrez. He won the actual PFA Player of the Year, and now he's won the best right winger of the year. So his life is actually completed. Now on to the best left winger of the year, and it's a complete shock. It is Charlie Daniels from Bournemouth. <laughs> I've seen him play this season. And I honestly think he's been absolutely amazing. He just shows passion. He's so direct. He does also play left back, so you could argue about that. But in my opinion, the award goes to Charlie Daniels. Now, the best striker of the year. You split between two, aren't you? Or you could say like Rashford or Aguero. They've both had good seasons too. Don't get me wrong. But in my opinion, it's between Vardy and Kane. I've given this award to... Harry Jamie Vardy. But now on to the the fun awards, the more fun awards, the more exciting awards. Goal of the season. Whoa, we've had some good goals this season, but there's a standout thing. This award goes to Jameson Vardy for his screamer against Liverpool. Absolutely screamer, just came to a down. Jamie Vardy. Hey, yeah, that's like sort of a bit of a memed commentary. Now we're going to the manager of the year. Absolutely easy. Claudio Ranieri. Claudio Ranieri. Claudio Ranieri. Claudio Ranieri. Yeah, manager of the year did without a doubt goes to Claudio Ranieri. Or Arsenal fans. Arsenal winger. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Now, this is one of my favourite awards, Personality of the Year. All I have to say about this award is chat shit, get banged. Jameson Vardy wins this without a doubt. What a legend. Earlier, he, um, a, a lookalike came on a full kit onto their bus going for lunch. He called him a wanker. Full kit wanker. What a legend Jamie Vardy is. Let's hope he can keep his form up in other seasons to come. Now we go on to the Young Player of the Year, and I agree with the PFA on this one. It goes to me, to Delhi Ali. What a young player that is. I'm glad he's English because he is going to be a very good player in the Euros. Now, player of the year is hard. There's players like Al Al Alexis Sanchez hasn't really been great. Harry Kane. Well, just look at that whole thing. Kante, Mares, Charlie Daniels, Jamie Vardy, Westman, Pete Smart, or yeah, Peter Michael could all be in with a shout. But I have given this award to Jamie Vardy. 
the next award. You think Chip Player Hero of the Year Award. These are the two big boy awards. We have the best skiller of the, of the year. This is going to Riyad Mahrez, the Algerian beast. What a signing that is. Did you know he's linked to Barcelona for a £20 million move? 90.6 million profit is not bad. I just like the way how he just tricks defenders so easily with like fake shots. He just literally just sends them the wrong way. Shout out Lamborghini. He just sends them the wrong way and scores from it, so he wins his hands down. Now my favourite player to watch this season. I hate to say that it's not a Norwich player, and I've given this award to Mesut Özil. I just like the way he's so controlled on the ball and he can pick out anyone. Crazy assist numbers. He's been absolutely amazing this season. And, yeah, I'm really impressed with him, actually. So, did you enjoy this video? Do you agree with my players? If you did, leave a... If you did, didn't. If you didn't, leave a comment down below. Tell me your opinions and who you thought should be player of the year and the big awards and whatever. Leave a like, comment, share it about. I've been Essential Football. I will see you in the next one. What do you think I should call the channel? Let me know.